tis the season for annual allergies. Dr. David Stepnick is here to help us survive the summer with less sneezing. Dr. Stepnick is an ear, nose, and throat specialist with Metro Health. Welcome to the show. Thank you very much. Now, are there really annual allergies and then also perennial allergies, kind of like plants? Uh, yes, there are. Uh, perennial allergies are things like dust and animal danders that we can be exposed to year round, whereas annual or seasonal allergies are things that occur from the spring through the summer and into the fall. Um, this is when there are various allergens that are out there that people are allergic to, and it's important to recognize that that can be different from city to city, city mm -hmm. and different parts of the country. Oh, okay, so there's no actually winter allergens out there? Uh, winter allergens would be, not, not that grow, but there are molds and, and animal danders that are winter allergens. But the people who have the grass allergies and stuff are probably happy to see winter come, huh? <laughs> they're, very, they're very happy, actually. The first hard frost of uh, fall is often something they look forward to. Okay, so what kind of allergens are out there right now? Uh, Midsummer is basically something where we see a lot of uh, grass allergens, so the pollens of the grasses. Um, you may remember that about a month or so ago, you'd go outside and you could take your finger and you could wipe along your car and you could see the green. Those were the tree allergens. The tree pollens were particularly heavy this year. Um, and in fact, I had a number of uh, people that would tell me that they're not allergic, but they would come in with typical allergy um, uh, symptoms that occurred from the tree pollens. And then later in the summer, we see things like ragweed and different weeds that come out and mature. Okay, but in, our, in Northeast Ohio, we get so little warm weather. It's here for such a short period of time, we don't want to be stuck indoors. So there's something we can do to make the allergens not quite so allergic, I guess? Uh, there is. Obviously, one of the most important things is avoiding the uh, pollens and whatnot. So that would be remaining indoors and particularly with an air conditioner on but we don't necessarily want to do that. So when we are outside, uh, one of the things to do is to try to limit the time you might be outside or when you come in um, to wash your clothes. Um, if you've had heavy exposure, maybe uh, washing, taking a shower. Um, and sometimes uh, saline or saltwater sinus rinses can actually help because the longer that the little particles stay inside the nose, the more of a response that we'll see. So that can be helpful as well. Okay, are there any medications that are useful? Uh, there are. There are several over-the-counter medications. Um, fairly recently, the nasal steroids, which, which used to be prescription only, were released as over-the-counter. Um, those can be used. It's important to recognize that those don't work right away. They take a while to build up and you have to use them regularly. Uh, people should be very cautious not to use decongestants like Afrin, which can be addictive. Um, one of the ones that's commonly uh, taken is um, an antihistamine. Um, those are pills. Um, those act very quickly. Um, but they have a short duration of action, basically a day or so. Um, and then for people that are particularly severe allergy sufferers, there are things that you can get from your physician, including things like allergy shots. And allergy shots do require a commitment, though. You have to go back uh, week after week after week, and it may be quite some time. And at Metro Health, we actually offer something like allergy slot shots where you get um, it uh, by something that's put underneath the tongue. And I think at this point, we're the only um, provider in Cleveland that does that. A little nicer than a shot, huh? It's nicer than a shot. <laughs> well, great information for us today. Are you sitting inside this summer because of your annual allergies? You can enjoy the great outdoors. Just follow Dr. Stepnick's advice to keep your allergy reactions within reason. My thanks to Dr. Stepnick for joining us today. Thank you. To learn more, call Metro Health at 216-778-7800 or log on to www.metrohealth.org. Next.